Hi, this is Cherry, and we're going to do a tour of the new museum honoring our beloved Captain Picard and the new series coming out on CBS All Access in 2020, Captain Picard First Duty. It will be following him in his retirement age at the family vineyard, I think, and of course meeting his family. It should be a lot of fun because I grew up watching The Next Generation, and so the new series doesn't start till 2020. You'll have time to watch not only Star Trek The Next Generation, but also Star Trek, the new series on CBS All Access. This is Cherry, and I am trekking with Captain Picard. So let's look at this museum where we're a part of Starfleet and we're checking out John Luke from the days of his being a cadet in 2326 all the way to his command where we got to know him in Star Trek The Next Generation. Wow, John Luke is an ensign in 2330 and his Starfleet officer's service uniform. John Luke is one of the most decorated officers and he retired in 2386 after more than 50 years of service, which is where I believe we'll be starting off from the new season. Oh, here is John Luke Picard, Captain John Luke Picard, with Lieutenant Commander Jack Crusher. Ah, the youth of our beloved captain. His wife. I'm happy that John Luke found love, of course. And his son. Wow. Didn't know that. A book of memories. Oh, it looks like we might be meeting his older brother, Robert. I'm very interested in the new series and exploring John Luke after his life of service. <laughs> Did he keep the Borg Queen skull? That would be very interesting. And of course we have to see a few of his awards. Not unexpected for the most decorated officer in Starfleet history. He did save us from the Borg. The Certificate of Honor, the Legion of Honor, presented to Jean-Luc Picard. Just a few more awards. Speed of Light Club. That Cadet Jean Luc Picard flew 300,000 kilometers per second in level flight in a Starfleet, Starfleet cruiser on April 4th, 2327. Even as a cadet Starfleet, Jean Luc Picard was breaking rules and showing his excellence to come. Commander Riker and Commander Deanna Troy's wedding, where I'm sure he was the honored counsel. Uh, definitely an attendee. And it looks like Commander Riker and Deanna Troy, both commanders, married and Riker eventually stepped to the promotion to captain in his own command on the USS Titan in 2379, I think. Mm, I like wedding cake. I think these are dress uniform. 
and this is probably what uh, Commander John Luke would have worn, as well as Commander Riker and Commander Troy. Well, not her. She got to wear like a real wedding gown <laughs> for the wedding ceremonies. And of course, as we all know, Commander Picard retired to his family's vineyard. Chateau Picard. I think they were red wine specialists. Uh, community. So here are a few badges. Star Trek communication badge from his various years of service. Oh, I think I remember that from one of the old episodes when he was grabbing tea one year. And of course, artwork. And the Custo Captain's Yacht. Ooh, Klingon weapons. So sharp and dangerous. John Luke was a Renaissance man with his ability to play beautiful music, which you can kind of hear over my shoulder that they're playing. Some of his favorite novels. His uniform. He was a very trim man. He is a very trim man. And of course, our ships. Culture, teacups, classic design never goes out of style, gifts from his first contacts, okay, I remember this. <laughs> And of course, our original crew on Star Trek The Next Generation, one of my favorite series. Now, if you didn't make it to San Diego Comic Con, let's check out some of the Star Trek branded merchandise you could have bought. But I think you can also buy it on the StarTrek.com website. We all know that everyone lo that Captain Picard loves cats, but he ended up with a dog, so team dog. And of course, Star Trek Generation has always been inclusive. Love wins. Make it so. Uh, I do love Captain Picard Day. What happened on the holodeck stays on the holodeck. Picard 2020 Riker for the next generation. I would rather have him in the White House than the current um, people. And I definitely want to do a wine tasting at Chateau Picard. <laughs> so cool. Really nice stuff. And of course, since he will be at a wine vineyard, you can buy wine glass. His family crust. Super cool. Hi, this is Cherry, and I want to thank you for joining me on my tour of Star Trek First Duty, the new series returning with our beloved Admiral Picard. It will be premiering on CBS All Access this 2020 early. We don't have a final date, but I definitely want to say Thank you, Picard, for your service and for saving us from the Borg. Going to have to give you a salute and a kiss. Thank you for your service. This is Cherry. Make sure you follow me at Cherry Los Angeles on YouTube for all geek news and, of course, my website, cherrydavis.org. I will be seeing you at the next con.